Hi, this is Paul from TradeTheFifth.com and this is my Daily Stock Signals video for Thursday the 16th of May. Now we've had a few days without these signals purely because I've been waiting for this ES pullback to find some sort of support, which I think it has done now. And uh, so uh, that has been reflected in a lot of these potential uh, growth stocks at the moment uh, where we've had that pullback in line with the S and that's presented a lot of wave four pullbacks. So I just want to go through one today. So I'm using our Elliott Wave Indicator Suite for the Think or Swim platform. It's all of, also available for MT4, Ninja Trader, TradeStation and Multicharts now. Uh, so you can see here uh, we've had a nice bullish run on FAF on the daily time frame, First American. And uh, we've had this pullback in line with uh, the, uh, the S&P right now. So there's a couple of things that we look at when we are measuring the performance of this wave four. So first of all, um, the wave four pulls back into one of our probability zones, part of our indicator suite here. So it's pulled back and found support in the green zone. Uh, that represents an 85% probability. It's going to go on and make a new wave five high into our automated target zone up here around about 59.70 in the middle of that target zone there. Um, now next, performance of the wave four is critical. One of the things we look at is our Elliott wave oscillator. This oscillator has to pull back between 90 and 140% on this wave four. It has done. If you if we really zoom in there yesterday, you can see it just went slightly negative through zero. So we're between uh, that zone, if you like. The next thing is our false breakout stochastic. When we get a strong bullish trend, we get these false breakout dots on the top here in the overbought zone. So when the stochastic crosses over against that and cr uh, then pulls back and crosses over in the oversold zone, the likelihood is it wants to go back and return to that main bullish trend. So we've got some really good indicators there, part of the software suite, to give us a, a good high probability looking trade. Now, entry for this, reasonably simple. We're looking for a, a move higher than uh, yesterday. We've got to be through our 6-4 moving average high. So this is the green moving average here, which we use for entry strategies for long, the red we use for entry strategies for the short. Um, so entry for FAF on the daily time frame for a swing trade is 56.06. It could trigger today, if not tomorrow. Uh, 53.95 is the stop loss, which is below the wave 4 pivot there and our target is in our automated target zone around about 59.62 is in the middle there so that's a risk to reward of 1 to 1.6 so great looking trade very simple to work out here whether you're swing trading a stock like this off a daily time frame or day trading futures or stocks off a five minute time frame these set up exactly the same so that's it for today have a great trading day speak to you all tomorrow